Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel OSVFX. Today I'm going to show you how to create this four point infographic slide in PowerPoint. So let's start. The first step is to create the circles. Go to new slide, insert shapes and select oval. And make the width and height as 1.6 inches. Fill color white and shape outline no outline make another circle by pressing ctrl d and give the height and width as 1.95 uh, inches and make the color as light gray and align center align middle same thing we will do the same alignment for the small circle Align center, align middle and bring to front. The next step is to create the rounded square. Go to insert tab, shapes, select the rounded square and give the height as 3.86 and width as 3.38 shape outline no outline and shape fill give uh, a gray color and increase the yes maybe this much okay make a duplicate copy by pressing ctrl d and go to insert tab select a square and i'm going to cut the rounded rectangle or the sorry the rounded square select the rounded square first and then select the rectangle go to merge shapes and say subtract and give this color light green or whatever color and bring exactly and align it properly group both the objects right mouse click group and exactly bring it here and send to back all right then i'll just make a copy of this one by pressing ctrl d and you can rotate it by pressing the alt and the right or left arrow key I'm pressing the right arrow key and bring it exactly here, align it properly and you can say send to back. Ungroup this one and select this object and bring to front as well as select these circles and bring to front so we have to do the similar exercise for the rest of the two uh, squares i'm just going to make this uh, square somewhat up okay and even this one all right now i'm going to select this one press ctrl d and alt left arrow key and bring it here send to back ungroup this and bring this to front select the circles again bring to front and I'm going to select this circle group it sorry not the circle the square group it and press ctrl D again alt and right arrow key and bring it here send to back again 
ungroup select this object and bring to front bring to front align it properly and give uh, different color shadings ungroup this I'm going to give a blue color this one maybe uh, purple and this one orange or yellow and give the outlinings shape outline make it white and increase the width the weight of the line okay and you can give uh, a shadow right mouse click go to format shapes fill or shadow you can select say maybe offset right and make it blur more blur the transparency you make it to 70 percent and do the remaining uh, shadow effect for the rest of the objects create one more circle insert shapes and circle size make it 2.95 inches and width also the same and give some dark gray colors and shape outline as white and you can increase the the weight and bring it here bring this front bring to front and exactly place it here in the center and this one also bring to front select the circles and bring to front same thing we'll do it for this one bring to front and select the inner circles all right so we'll do the remaining bring to front and all right I have got some icons with me I'm just going to place this one you can place it here all right and I'm just going to give some a shadow effect here for this circle Add the text here all right uh, that's it from me friends hope you enjoyed this uh, video and if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel osvfx see you soon with more interesting stuff till then goodbye